So what did I learn after using Dr. Squatch's soaps exclusively for six months straight? I'm gonna share with you. So what's up everybody? I'm Mike, this is Bald and Strong, where being bald is a lifestyle and I wanna help you make the most of it. If this is your first time, welcome. And please subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you won't miss any of my future content. So last year I did a couple of videos on Dr. Squatch first impressions a week later, but after using them for six months straight, I really learned more about their product and them. Essentially being what I love about them and what I think needs improvement. Let's start with what I actually love about them. First, they're very organic, natural, green, whatever you want to call it, friendly. Another pro for them is they have quite a selection compared to other organic and green natural soaps. There's just no comparison. If you found one that has more or even the same, comment down below, send me the link. I want to check it out. I like how Dr. Squatch has grown from just soaps. I mean, they have toothpaste, which I have tried, and I'll do another video on that later. I have also like the fact that they have deodorant, shampoos, which let's face it, us bald enthusiasts and baldies don't really need shampoo, but it's nice that they're branching out. Also even cologne. But unfortunately, that's kind of where the pros in my book end for Dr. Squatch. Now for where I think they need some improvement is their shipping and response time. I understand there's a little bit of a pandemic going on still, but it's kind of bad. In some cases, I was worried about running out of soap in between my orders. Now, of course, I could just go to the store and buy some soap, but that would defeat the purpose of buying it from Dr. Squatch, who is dominantly online. They really don't have too many retail locations. And if you know some retail locations, please comment down below and post the link. I'd like to check that out. Another area I think that needs improvement is the longevity of the soap product when you get it. I'm realizing that um, bar soap was lasting me about a week. And given the price of these soaps, that seems a bit expensive. So that, Dr. Squatch, if you're watching, please maybe try and do something about that. Now I shower on average twice a day, once in the morning, once in the evening. It's just sort of my routine, but I don't think showering twice a day is too much to ask to get more than about a week out of a bar of soap. It just, what I'm realizing is, is once the soap actually gets in the shower and you're using it, it starts to get soft and it really starts to go quick. I'm realizing that. I mean, is it too much to ask to get maybe two weeks out of a bar of soap? I mean, honestly, 